am Mandy Benson and I'm a Workflow Administrator. My name's Emily Manthorpe and I'm a Workflow Administrator. My name is Sharon Joseph. I'm a Clinical Coder and Administrator. I read clinical letters. I code them if necessary, decide whether or not the GP needs to see the letter. The main benefit for what I do as a workflow administrator is that I'm saving GPs a lot of time, a lot of admin time. So if they're reading a letter saying, oh, this patient didn't attend this appointment, we're going to send them another letter in the post. Does the GP need to see that? No. A good example would be a letter that we'd received from another department for the patient may have gone for an eye screening test at the diabetes centre and all it is is just the results regarding their tests. We're trained to see what is coded and what is actionable by us and what is actionable by a GP. So in terms of letters like this, they tend to just get completed because they're results and they don't need to be seen by anybody else. We got great feedback from the GPs saying how helpful it was to them and it's been a real, a real success story. We actually feel that we're more valued, we feel more part of the team, um, we feel proud if we can code correctly, you know, we take it very seriously, these are patient records. I am able to view a patient's journey through their letters so you understand what they're going through and also that helps you pick up things that you might not usually. We're, we're really enthusiastic to learn all the time. Our clinical lead is always happy to um, help us with a problem that we have or a query. It's made our job more interesting. If I'm a little bit unsure about what to do with the letter, I'll just put a little note and I'll send it to the GP saying, do you know what, I saw this and I'm not sure, what do you think? And um, So it doesn't matter which GP I ask, they're all really, really helpful. We've got loads of help to learn for this job. It is, it is a complex job, but it is something that is necessary. So the help is abundance. It guarantees the safety of our work for a patient to ensure that everything is done correctly and on a timely fashion. To be a good workflower, you need to have a knowledge of your clinical system. You need to have a knowledge of how primary care works in a GP practice. I think that if you want to be a workflow administrator, you have to be precise but quick. I think the benefit of working with the administrator is they feel more empowered, um, so they're having a much greater role really. And, and I think within that it, it expands their role from simply just reading letters and typing to actually getting involved in patient care.